Hello everybody, in this video I am going to show you how to add a stop loss and a take profit to your trade in one action. To begin, inside of Ninja Trader 8, open up your charting software and have a blank chart loaded. Once your blank chart is loaded, navigate to the top of the toolbar and select from the icons Chart Trader. With one left click, select that option and go to the middle which is Chart Trader. Once Chart Trader is fully loaded, on the side you will notice your buy, your sell market orders, as well as your pending orders, your buy ask and sell ask, buy bid, sell bid, your reverse and close. Below all of these options, you will see a section that says ATM strategy. ATM strategy stands for Advanced Trade Management. From this, you will see a drop down box. Left click this drop down box and select custom. Once you have custom selected, you will see a new window appear that says custom strategy parameters. Once this window appears, you will see order quantity. In this example, this says one. And what this represents is one contract. Next to this is time and force, which is set to GTC, also known as good till cancel. Below that is parameter types. From here, you could select the drop down box to currency, percent, price, ticks, or pips. For this example, I will set ticks. After that, you will see under here, target one, quantity, stop loss, profit, and stop strategy. For this example, I am just going to show you how to add a simple stop loss and take profit to the position. So in this example, let's say you decide you would like to do a 20 tick stop loss from your point of entry. To add that stop loss, you will just change this field from one to 20 for your take profit. Let's say you do your research and you would like to set your profit objective to 40 ticks from your point of entry. If that is what you decide, enter in 40 into the profit box. Once everything is completed, you can save this as a template so you can easily recall these settings for a later time. All you have to do is click save as template and name it to whatever you choose. For this example, I will put in stop loss 20, take profit 40 and select save. Once I'm done with this, I will click OK. And from my drop down window, I will now see this particular setting listed in the ATM settings. If I would like to use these settings, I will select it from here and you will see it now in the drop down box. Once everything is set up with this, if I would like to place a sell order, I can click sell market order. Order's and order with failed. that, I am entered into a position with one contract with a 20 tick stop loss and then a 40 tick take profit. This trade will remain active until either the stop loss or the take profit has been fulfilled. If I would like to manually close this and avoid having the market reach one of those levels, I can do so by clicking the close button order filled. and that cancels all open positions and pending orders related to that trade. If I would like to place a buy order with those same settings, all I have to do is click buy market. One left click order filled. and now I'm entered into a position with a buy market order and I have a stop loss set to 20 ticks below the point of entry and a take profit of 40 ticks above the entry.